Hey guys, what is up? This is Nathan. My basement is still flooded and we are still playing Harvest Moon for Super Nintendo. And I believe it is the 27th of spring today. Saturday 27th, so stores are closed. But it is almost... oh dear. Yeah, that'll work out good. Uh, it is almost time for summer, which means it's almost time for a whole new set of crops. And uh, look, our house is done. You can notice it was a little bit bigger on the inside. And now we got a clock. Anyway. Uh, yeah. So if you press select, it'll give you the day, and it'll tell you the clock, it'll tell you the time, and then sometimes it'll give you a little note at the end, too. Going to have a good day today. See? Hi, dog. So anyway, uh, this is what, uh, the clock is like, and we're about to get on to spring now. So, let's feed the chicken. I guess we're not going to make it to spring today. We'll probably only get a couple days in, but, um, still... It'll be, uh, it'll work out fine. It'll be, be good. I did try to cut the grass uh, last night, and it was not ready. And we do have some turnips that are ready today. And I am still going to have potatoes growing uh, in those spots into summer. But that's okay, because what I'll do is I'll plant tomatoes in those spots, and so I'll wait until that's out. You know, really, there's an easy way to do this, but my OCD is not going to let me. So uh, what I'm going to do is as soon as those potatoes on the far left are done, I'm going to... Uh, and plant tomatoes there because tomatoes grow faster. In the meantime, I'll plant corn over here because it sells for more and grows slower and let it be going. So, uh, let's go on to our chores then. Get a flower for Anne. And, uh, yeah, see what we have time for after that. Now, uh, it's going to cost us another... Um... 10,000 I think to upgrade our house again which we do want to upgrade it again pretty much as soon as we can um, that would be good um, so yeah we'll upgrade our house soon uh, as long as we're really married by fall we're going to be doing pretty good uh, I'm pretty sure so uh, let's go ahead and get another flower to her today um build up our affection as much as we can because you want to get married and have as at least one anniversary uh, before the end of the game preferably two so it'd be nice if we could be married um, before the end of summer but like I said anniversary is a good chance to raise your happiness level um, out the wazoo so yeah so oh dear we may not make it if we don't we'll just give a yeah we're gonna make it I think so today I uh, <clears throat> I managed, I, I finally got uh, Oblivion in the mail. I actually got it a lot faster than I thought I would. But I almost didn't have a video today because I spent so much time, uh, spent so much time uh, playing Oblivion that, you know, I, I almost just kind of gave up on this because I've been taking the TV away from my wife all day. But uh, I, could, I would use the basement, like I said, but it's still flooded. So let's go, uh, let's go water our crops. So Oblivion is a really good game. I'm still learning it, though. Uh, obviously, it's a, man. I am I am insanely impressed at how in depth uh, the game goes. I mean, just with different classes and races and attributes and everything. It's it's really impressive. Um, I don't really. I probably don't know what I'm doing, but I started a uh, I started a class, or I made I made my own class and used a lot of magic and a lot of you know heavy armor and weapons and strength and things like that. Uh, so I'm hoping that it will turn out uh, it'll turn out okay. But anyway, we'll just have to wait and see because I, I still have no idea what I'm doing in the game. But I like it a lot so far. Yep. So I can't really think of much to talk about. You guys should comment and give me ideas for discussion. Um, yeah. Let's see, just got a few more left to water. And then we'll go to bed and call it a day. And I think we're going to make it. Actually, I may test out... Um, if I have enough energy, I may test out 
the sickle and see if we can cut our grass yet. Because, um, I mean, we have more grass than what we need at the moment, especially at the rate it's growing, but the more you can have, the better. And I really need to get to, get on to buying more grass, too, if I want to be able to have a lot of livestock. I'd love to ideally have a ton of grass by this winter so that I can keep buying livestock and keep, you know, buying up cattle and stuff um, during the during the winter or uh, not during the winter but during the during the oh yeah during the winter and during the fall too because there's no crop you can grow in fall either so it's those times you kind of go to you start to rely on the crops and I realize most of the time that I am watering here and working here I usually walk all the way over here to refill my watering can when I can walk like five feet down below and and get it. Let's just test and see if the grass is ready. If it is, then we'll go to the we'll go to the hot tub or yeah, it's ready. We'll go and refill our energy then and cut grass and then we'll call it a night and we should have enough time for another day too. Who knows? Maybe we'll see a uh, squirrel or something like that and raise our happiness level. Not that it matters because it's going to drop when we sell a chicken again tomorrow. No, the next day because tomorrow's a Sunday. Yeah. So I guess at least it's nice that everything closes like a consistent times. In the later games, um, in the later Harvest Moon games, like every store is closed like on different days. Like most stores are closed on Sundays and then they have like one random day throughout the week. And so you have to memorize almost a different uh, schedule for every single store in the game, which can get a little bit frustrating, but I suppose, you know, it's maybe realistic. It's kind of funny, the town that uh, we live in here in Virginia, actually, it's, I don't know why, but for some reason, ev almost every single store in the town is closed on Monday. Uh, I took my wife to get a kitten, because she had been wanting a kitten, and uh, we decided to get her one as an early Christmas gift. Oh, I took her to get a kitten, um, on a Monday because Monday is a day off for me and the animal shelter was even closed uh, on that day but like half of like downtown shuts down and it's kind of frustrating because you know that's my day out that's my day to actually get stuff done but yeah and almost done cutting the grass it's kind of strange um, I'm on my upstairs TV right now since the basement's been flooded and it's a uh, it's 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 like a newer flat screen TV that we got when we first moved in here, and uh, it makes everything really wide. And so yesterday, actually, when when I did my first LP on this on this computer on this game or my first Harvest Moon LP on this TV, it, it felt really weird because I couldn't I didn't know it seems like you ran faster to the side or something because it was a greater distance. But oh well, let's go to bed, and we will uh, call it a night and work tomorrow as well. It is a 28th. And I guess right back there, back behind that, that is the clock I suppose they give you. And there's just sort of a, a, a check on everything. Yeah. Just kind of tells you your money, your livestock, everything. Oh, it's going to rain tomorrow. Which is good for us. Because we won't have to water. Let's see. Unless we plant, which we will be planting tomorrow. Dag nabbit. Don't want you around. We should have a chicken ready, I think. No, we don't, actually. Okay, good. Chicken be ready tomorrow. Ah, won't do any good because you can't sell chickens in the rain. Livestock dealer doesn't, doesn't do business that way. Because uh, it makes them sick. Which is frustrating because in the later games, you can uh, you can sell livestock on those days. But oh well. What are you going to do, huh? The world is what it is. 28th, yeah, 29th, and 30th. Okay. I think actually maybe those potatoes, those other crops are going to turn out just right. So no worries. Don't worry, be happy. See if we can get a couple flowers to Anne today. I mean, it is a huge difference in uh, playing the other games. I really, I really would like to really look forward to doing an LP of like Trio Tranquility. Um, which I don't know, I might try to make it an achievement LP uh, anyway, because, um, you know, it wouldn't be a huge achievement. But, uh, well, first time I ever played, um, I ever played 
Harvest Moon Tree of Tranquility, the Wii one, um, is actually on a friend's Wii, and it was his, at the time, fiance's game. Because she liked Harvest Moon a lot. Uh, he didn't really care for it, but he had a Wii, and so he bought uh, Harvest Moon for her. And I would go to his room in college and, like, play the game all the time. Like, constantly. And so, um... <clears throat> anyway, I, I never really had the strong desire to have a Wii before that. And I have to say, very honestly, sincerely, that, um... That game, Harvest Moon Tree Tranquility, is pretty much the reason I bought a Wii. Now, granted, I'm, I'm glad for all the other games that I have for it. And, you know, I can download Harvest Moon for Super Nintendo, things like that. But really, when you get down to it, that was the reason. Um, so, I guess I feel kind of silly. Um, but it was, I think it was totally worth it. I bought it used from a friend. Yeah, we got her too. Okay, good. Get to get more affection, tell her... Yes, again. So anyway, um, yeah, so I bought Harvest Moon just so I could, or I bought a Wii from another friend just so I could play, get a Harvest Moon game and play it, but I'm glad they came out with another Harvest Moon game later. So anyway, back to my story I was telling. Wow, I got way sidetracked there. Um, the reason, or well, I, I played through it the first time, and I started playing, well, I started playing through the game, and I had a, I was doing pretty well on it, and was pretty far ahead of schedule, I guess, or, well, I shouldn't say that. I mean, I guess I was doing decent. I was learning it. But then something happened, like he had to erase my game, like when he copied the games to something else. Somehow it erased, like, my game data. Uh, I'm not really sure exactly what happened there. But anyway, I had to start over. And so I knew how to do it. Um, I knew how to play the game after that. Um, and so, like, when I got my own Wii, I just copied the data to that and finished it. And because I knew how to play the game, I got a head start, and I ended up beating the game... Uh, right after, like, just over a year into the game. Um, I don't know, I thought that was a pretty good achievement. Um, you have to ring... Is it ring bells? No, ring bells is uh, animal parade. You have to uh, oh, make magical rainbow bridges. That's right. That's what I hate about the newer games. Had to make magical rainbow bridges uh, to fanciful lands. But anyway, I managed to do all that in, a, in like a year in like three days or something like that. And so I might try to make that in... Um, an, an achievement, an achievement LP, uh, if I were to do Harvest Moon Tree of Tranquility, because there's actually not that many uh, Tree of Tranquility LPs that I've seen, at least I haven't looked super recently. But I'd um, love to do one and show how to get everything really fast. Uh, I'd have to probably play through it again, or at least get all my, at least, you know, do some research on some websites and stuff, look stuff up, uh, before I would be uh, definitely able to, to, uh, I'm out of water. Before I would definitely be able to to do it that fast again, but uh, I might would be able to. So maybe that'll be an achievement LP. And I pause there because I just realized something absolutely horrible. I saved my last game. So if uh, I saved like when I went to bed this past night. So if my game messes up or if my recording messes up and I skip a day, you guys are going to miss a day in that. And I'm terribly sorry, but I don't know how else to. Uh, else to put it together, but we can just hope that it will turn out okay. So I suppose if you're watching this and you're hearing this right now, it probably will turn out okay. So, but I'm going to test my video before I, uh, before I, uh, save for tonight. And, uh, if it doesn't work, I just say screw it and not save the game and redo this tomorrow and there won't be a video tonight. But if you're watching this, uh, in the morning, I suppose that would be Thursday. No, yes, Thursday. Then, uh, then everything will be great. So, keep in mind, four stones here. Just, just keep remembering that. So, guys, thanks a lot for watching. Sorry, the commentary hasn't been too good. Um, I guess my mind's still on oblivion or something. But anyway, uh, I appreciate your views. Keep watching. Uh, like, subscribe, and go over and see my friends at Harvest Moon Paradise. So, thanks a lot.